I am tired. Let me quickly share some things that I learned today. I finished the book Success is for You by David Hawkins, the one I've been mentioning in some of my previous videos. And when Dr. Hawkins talked about how you can reach nirvana, that state of being completely one with everything and that total peace, he said, Number one, the desire to reach that state must be intense. Number two, then act with forgiveness and gentleness, compassionate towards everything, including yourself. Number three, next, surrender each thought, feeling, desire, and deed. Mind becomes silent then. And number four, focus, not even a moment of distraction while doing ordinary activities. This is hard at first, but it gets easier with time. Those all sound like super difficult things to do. <laughs> It's no wonder if very few people reach the state of nirvana. I think I'll try with step one and two, the intense desire to reach that state, act with forgiveness and gentleness, be compassionate towards everything. And then I learned something from a TikTok surprisingly, but I had to watch it again and again and I actually took notes from it. This is from uh, some writings by Fyodor Dostoevsky. Dostoevsky, I guess that's the proper way to say it. Isn't it funny how when I stopped caring about everything that all my problems begin to vanish? This is akin to what Reality Transurfing says about reducing importance. He says when something stresses you out, when you have a problem, reduce its importance. Easier said than done because we just automatically attribute so much importance to small things. And the next point is something that Jordan Peterson says all the time. He must have gotten this from Dostoevsky because he talks about this all the time. Don't lie. Most importantly, don't lie to yourself. A person who lies to themselves, buys into their own falsehood, reaches a point where they can't discern the truth within or around them. Consequently, they lose respect for themselves and others. Without respect, love fades away, paving the way for indulgence in base pleasures and vices as a means to fill the void left by the absence of love. It all stems from the constant deception of others and oneself. So don't lie, especially to yourself. I've been sleeping about seven and a half hours every night. And the fact that I'm this tired today, that's kind of been building up and I had to take a nap today. I mean, I just woke up from my nap and it's 9.25 PM right now. I think I slept like a half an hour or something like that. Maybe, maybe close to an hour. I guess seven and a half hours is not enough sleep for me. So I need more sleep. And since Tigger, the cat keeps waking me up every morning, I should go to bed earlier. So I'll try to be in bed by 10 PM. Although since I have to edit this video, it'll probably be past that. At least I got some reading done today, finished the book, Success is for You, and I got my priorities done in the morning, so that was good. Oh, and I just wanted to say that I noticed that one of my videos a few days ago started popping off. This video right here, it started getting, I mean, right now it has almost 200 views, which has never really happened other than my phone review videos. So one of my daily videos getting this many views, that's unexpected. So that was cool, I guess these kind of things will happen if I just keep posting every day. So I'll keep it up and see what happens. One percent better every day, baby.